After the cicada infestation took over central PA, we're told there's another outbreak that leaves local experts concerned, a gypsy moth takeover. It's an outbreak actually that could mean major damage to forests and even your own backyard. Our Alyssa Royster spoke with experts on the infestation. She joins us now live. So Alyssa, what are experts saying about what led to this year's outbreak? Matt, I'm told that gypsy moth outbreaks come in cycles, but the reason that they're so abundant this year is the warm, dry weather. According to forest health manager Dr. Donald Egan, gypsy moths go through six different growing stages, but right now they're in the final stage, which means they're doing the most feeding. It also means that there will be a lot of defoliation. I asked Dr. Egan what people can do about it, but he says at this point, nothing. When we get to June at this stage, stage of the game, it's too late. You needed to do something in the month of May. Our first spray day was May 10th, and our last spray day was May 27th. We had eight spray aircraft, six fixed-wing aircraft, and two helicopters. Dr. Egan tells me that outbreaks last about two to three years, so he says it could be just as bad next year. In State College, Alyssa Royster, WTAJ News.